Hey there, Tanya from Techretaries here. I want to show you how to mark up an image in Preview. So here I am, I've got my image open, and I want to draw onto this image and add some text. It's a little bit easier to visually show something than to type it up in an email. So that's what I'm going to do here. So first thing we want to do is find the markup tool in the upper right here looks like a little circle with a pen inside. So click on that to open up the toolbar. Then the first thing I want to do is draw. So I'm going to go over to the sketch tool on the left side here. And you know it's on because it's highlighted. And then I'm going to go to a color. I like orange, of course. And then I'm just going to draw a circle. And you'll notice that preview changes it to a perfect circle. I can also use the natural version, which looks a little more hand-drawn, which is cute or I can do the the perfect circle and I'm going to choose the perfect circle. And if I were to draw, let's say for example, an arrow, preview knows some basic shapes like circles, arrows, rectangles and just knows to turn that into a perfect shape and it just looks really clean, so I like to use that. And then I'm going to add some text. I'm going to come up here to the text box little T and then it places the text and you can see the two balls, there are two little balls that appear um, on either side of the text box. I can't really see my text because it's in black so I'm going to move it out of the way and put it right underneath where I want to write and then I'm going to go up to the A which is uh, text style so I can change the size, I can change the font and then the color. And then I can even make it bold. And then start typing. And then if I click outside and I click on it again, I get the little hand like that. And then I can drag it out of the way. So once you're happy with your text, position it where you want it. And you get that nice little yellow line that'll center it. And that looks pretty good. And then when I'm done, I can share it. I can do mail. I can do messages. I'm going to go ahead and do mail. So mail opens up, and as you can see here, it's actual size, which is great. But sometimes it shows up as small, and that's a little too small. I can't see the text, so the person on the other end wouldn't be able to see the text. So I use large or actual size. You can get away with medium as well but I really like, yeah, medium looks good, but I really like actual size so that people can really see what I'm talking about on the other end. And that's it. That's a tutorial on markup in preview and sending in mail. Thanks for watching. Bye.